Hello, I'm Frank Morris and this is my video tip of the week from studythecode.com. This week we're going to continue our series of going through the glossaries at random of the I-Codes and the National Electrical Code. This week we're going to discuss boarding houses as described in the 2009 International Building Code and the 2009 International Zoning Code. Based on the 2009 International Building Code, a boarding house is a building used to accommodate people for lodging for pay. This lodging can be with meals or without meals. A boarding house would generally house people that were not related to each other other on a permanent basis. In section 310.1 you will find that a boarding house can be classified as a R1 transient or a R2 non-transient. When we look at the word transient we are talking about someone that stays for a maximum of 30 days. So a non-transient person would stay longer than 30 days. With regards to the 2009 International Zoning Code, it has some additional information with regards to the definition of a boarding house. In this code, it states a boarding house is a single dwelling unit that has no more than 10 sleeping units for compensation for more than one week, with the remaining portion of the definition being equal to the definition in the building code. I'm Frank Morris and this is another one of my video tips of the week. For more detailed information on this code item and other code items, you can find them at our website at www.studythecode.com. Thanks for watching.